Hello everyone, welcome to Vinod Rathinam Tutorials. In this video, we will learn about the comparison and logical operators. What is comparison operator? From the name itself, you can guess its usage. It is used to compare the values. And the output is a boolean. Boolean is nothing but true or false according to the condition. And this comparison operator can also be called as relational operator. We will see each operator with sample code. Sample code. Here we are going to compare two values. A contains 20, B equal to 10. The first condition A is greater than B. Of course you know very well 20 is greater than 10. The output will be true. As we already know the output is a boolean value. Just run it. The output is true. But the output message is not so good. Let's do a small decoration with an another concept. I implemented the code format a comma b. This is used to print the values dynamically. You have to use two curly braces. Then dot format a comma b comma the condition. If you give like this, what will happen during execution is the value of a will be printed here. The value of b will be printed here. And finally, it is checking the condition. Now we will execute and see. The output looks much better when compared to the previous condition. 20 is greater than 10 and is true. Similarly, I implemented the code for all the conditions. As a programmer, we must know the output before we execute. The second condition is less than b. 20 is less than 10, which is not true. So this output will be false. And the third condition, whether a equal to b that is 20 equal to 10 once again which is also not true so you will get the output as false in the fourth condition we are validating whether a is not equal to b that is 20 is not equal to 10 which is a true condition then in the fifth condition we are validating a is greater than or equal to b here we are checking two operators in a single statement for example for a student's false under greater than or equal to 35 marks will be set as passed final condition we are validating a is less than or equal to b which is not true we will get the false statement now we will execute so the execution is completed we will analyze the result 20 is greater than 10 which is a true statement 20 is less than 10 which is not true we got the output false then 20 equal to 10 once again it is false then 20 is not equal to 10 of course this condition is true then 20 is greater than or equal to 10 is also true and finally 20 is less than equal to 10 is false hope you got an idea about what is comparison or relational operators you can find the definitions and also sample example mentioned in this table. The next operator is logical operators. We have three types of logical operators and or not. Let's see with an example. For simplicity, I mentioned just two conditions A and B. But in real time scenario, we can have any number of conditions. What this code exactly will do is whenever you use and you will get true statement only if all the conditions are true. Here A is true but B is false. When we execute the output will be false. For better clarity explaining with an example x is equal to 50 y is equal to 100. So the first condition we are checking both x equal to y which is false x is less than y that is 50 is less than 100 which is true when you use the logical operator and the output will be false this is the example for and operator similarly we have or operator same code whenever you use or operator if any one statement is true then you will get the output as true in the AND operator, both the statements should be true. But in OR operator, any one or both the operators, if it is true, the output will be true. So we executed. We know this condition is true. It is 50 is less than 100. So the output is true. The third statement is NOT operator. Whenever you mention the NOT statement, you will get the reverse of the output. 
that is if it is true you will get false if it is false you will get true in this example we know a is true so you will get not a means you will get the output false 50 equal to 100 which is a false but we will get output as true 50 is less than 100 which is true but we will get output as false so we executed as explained this is how we got the answer false true false hope you understood both the comparison and the logical operators till now if you are clear this is more than enough then you can find materials in this url the comparison relational operator and the logical operators that's the end of this video thanks for watching happy learning